is Kamori, and today we're going to talk about how to set up a cosplay photo shoot. Now, like most things in cosplay, we are going to start with the internet. Like with a lot of things in cosplay, start with social media. Find photographers whose work you like and who go to the same conventions that you do, and then follow them on social media. A lot of times when a event is coming up, a photographer will post what events they're going to, when they have photo shoots available, uh, what the rates are for photo shoots, if they do paid photo shoots, and just follow all that. And a lot of them will have some sort of uh, Google Doc you can fill out or some other application process that makes it super easy to sign up for photo shoots. If a photographer you like doesn't have a obvious form on social media, you can just try sending them a polite message, say, hey, I like your work, would you be interested in collaborating at some point? You can also check forms. A lot of photographers will post on forums. For me in particular, I have found one of the best places to find photo shoots through forums is through the cosplay.com photo shoot scheduling forums. I've booked a lot of photo shoots that way and I definitely recommend it. Now, I feel like it needs to be said that even if you are meeting up at a convention, you are still setting up a meeting with a stranger from the internet. Now, it's always good to trust your instinct. If you get a bad vibe from the photographer, it is okay to refuse the photo shoot. It is okay to send them a message and be like, hey, sorry, something came up, I can't go through with the photo shoot. And you don't have to do the shoot if you are not comfortable. One thing you can also do is bring a friend to the photo shoot. Now, it is polite to tell the photographer, hey, do you mind if I bring a friend as an assistant? Um, and honestly, in the five years that I've been cosplaying with doing photo shoots, I have never had a photographer say no. So if you have a photographer who says, no, you can't bring anyone with you, that is kind of sketch and is kind of a red flag, so I probably wouldn't go through with the photo shoot. If you can't set up a photo shoot for whatever reason with a cosplay photographer, that doesn't mean you can't get photos of your costume. One thing you can do is do a photo shoot with your friends. Have your friends dress up in cosplay and take turns taking photos of each other. You don't have to have like a really fancy camera to get good photos. You can just use a basic point and shoot. And even most cell phones nowadays have a camera in them. So just practice, see a couple angles, try some different lighting, and just take a bunch of photos until you get some that you're happy with. For example, my Junko Enoshima cosplay, this photo was taken by my husband on his smartphone camera in like two seconds, and personally, I kind of like it. Now, if you still can't take photos with friends, that's okay. That doesn't mean you still can't get photos. You do have one more option, and that is to take photographs of yourself. Now, this is a bit harder than the other things, but it can be done. And all you need is a camera with a self-timer function and a tripod of some sort so that you can get the angle you want and just keep posing in front of the camera until you get the shot that you want. Now one cosplayer that is amazing at doing self-photography is It's Raining Neon, so I will link to her Facebook page in the description below. And those were some tips on how to set up a cosplay photo shoot. If you have any suggestions for any videos you'd like to see me make, let me know in the comments below. And for more cosplay and sewing videos, please subscribe. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.